my name is Mai and I'm here with my good friend Austin and this is your Room 12 Report. Today we will interview some of Ms. Yeager's fourth grade students to see what they liked about the blended learning class. Oh, and if you're wondering, Ms. Yeager is our teacher here in Room 12. She's an amazing teacher. She has our laptops, tablets, and our green screens. And also, if you're wondering what a green screen is, a green screen is a piece of green cloth that you can just stand in front of, choose an image, and say what you want to say. There's also a green screen app by Doink on the App Store for only $2.99. Okay, Maya, now tell us, who is our first person to interview? First up, we have Maddie to interview about what she liked about fourth grade. Okay. Save it. And will you tell me what you like about fourth grade? Hello, what I really like about fourth grade is that you get to study for your test online and on paper. Sometimes we play games like Kahoot and that's why most of our tests have amazing test scores. We also watch fun videos to study for tests. Cool, what is Kahoot? Well, Kahoot is a game that you can play for any subject just as long as it exists. Awesome. My next question is, what type of videos do you watch before test? Video sites that we like to use are Khan Academy and Learnzillion. That's where we get all of our videos from. So, I'm guessing these videos are helping you to get those amazing test scores you were talking about. Am I right? Yep. That, is that all your questions? Yes. Thank you for your time, Maddie. Bye. Blend and learning class sound like fun. I agree. Next, we will talk to Amy about what she likes about the blended learning class. Amy, why don't you come on in? Hi, Amy. And what did you like about fourth grade? I really like my awesome teacher. But besides that, my favorite part about the blended learning class is most of the assignments are on the computer. Few are on paper. My favorite site is Google Classroom. Because instead of having your teacher handwrite it, she or he will just type it on the site. When, and when it is agenda book time, you can just search Google Classroom and then click a few things and there's the agenda book. Wow, that sounds awesome. How does your teacher fix something if it's wrong and you're at home and you really want to tell her? Well, there's a comment box under the agenda where we would type where we would ask the question when we're at home. Anything else you want to ask me? Well, actually, yes. Um, how do you go to the links that your teacher puts on your agenda book? Well, you just have to click on the agenda book below the thing that says the assignment. Then you will click on the blue highlighted thing there. And that's where the link goes. Oh. Wow, very interesting. Um, now, I have one last question for you, Amy. Yeah? Um, how do you write on this app or computer? Um, say if you have an assignment and you have to write it out, but you can't write on the agenda book, how would you do that? First, you have to go onto the thing that says assignment. Then you have to click on it. Next, you should see something that says new document or like that and click on, some, click on the link that says new document and then go to the Google or document or Google doc for short. On that Google Doc, you can write your answers or your sh or your story for Miss Yeager, and you can click on it to see who have, who's completed the assignment. Any more questions I can answer for you? Nope, you answered all my questions. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Wow, these interviews were great. It seemed that blended learning classes are fun. I agree, but still, there's a whole lot more you could talk about a blended learning class. Well, we don't have time to go through all of that in one video. Yeah, because this video is just about over. In fact, bye! So were we 